Hello, Stratters, Dan here. Uh, it's been four months almost. So I'm pretty rusty. But I am playing pauper. I can't, can I keep this? Heck, I don't know. I'm gonna try to keep it. It's this... Uh... Oh, he knows me. Um, this was probably a horrible keep. Uh, hmm. But I'm gonna go plant expedition map and hope for the best. And see what we can do. So shout out to Maximum Mike for being my first opponent. I don't know if I'm back or not, but I just couldn't stay away. I can't promise any regular content yet. Uh, my true crime podcasts are being enormous successes. Uh, so I'm doing really well. Uh, I'm thinking of digging up another land with Expedition Map. And then I can crop rotate into the last one. But to what end? It is an end in itself, isn't it? I'm in a new studio. I actually record in a room where I've never played Magic before again. It's the Sky Lair, if you follow my video blog, if you search my name. He looks to be hexproof, I don't have anything against that, do I? And I want to thank the video makers, the, the, the two guys who have kept things going. That's hexproof, alright. So how do I handle that? That must be a terrible matchup. I would remember if I played Magic in four months. So I'm getting the mine. Uh, moments piece is of course good enough to save me here. Can I die next turn? I'm pretty sure I can. Uh, Bog Prism. That's wrong. Hmm. I can't moments piece this turn. I need to get the prism down for future moment pieces. So I am going mine prism. Then I could oh can corporate the island. That seems pretty good actually. So I crop rotate the island. So I just need to survive this turn. Right, oh, so to like two moments pieces will save me. Uh, maybe I will die. No, I live another turn. And I can safely crop rotate into um, the tower uh, all right very good and now we have green there we can flicker what would we flicker um, nothing And I don't have a way to draw cards. Play the stupid signet. We can flicker the prism. To draw cards that seems excessive. So we're gonna spend a turn piecing here. Hope to draw into something. I guess Dinrova Horror does stuff. Our odds look pretty grim here. Pretty bleak. Uh, but here is uh, something. We definitely need to bounce a lot of stuff. Slippery bogel. It's the bogel. Should I try to draw a card here? It just seems so bad. And we don't have to do it yet. 
because we could draw two things. So, moment's peace is safe. Oh, forbidden alchemy seems like a good thing to do. So, we are doing that. Ta da! Three mana, five mana, alchemy. Pay two. Look at the top four cards of your library. Um, I do, do want the crusher, it doesn't do enough, right? I just die next turn instead. So I need to take alchemy here, right? I don't know if you rest into graveyard, but alchemy in the graveyard costs seven. That's a lot. I can't get to seven mana. Hmm. I could get to seven. I think I'm gonna take the crusher. I am definitely not sure here. And now I can't do much else. So we are just going to... Moments please one more time and look for stuff. Look for stuff that will save us from these evil hexproof guys. So now I'm facing 25 power and I have 12 life, but that's not a problem. Because we can have peace, just one more moment. But then the next moment we will be dead. Very dead. But we still have a draw phase and we have a lot of mana. How much mana? You ask. I think it's nine. He is communing with the gods. The gods just doesn't listen to us. They don't listen to us. They don't listen to him either. He can't beat Moment Space. He has no way around it. I don't think he has a way around it. But uh, we don't have any Moment Space. How many are main deck? How many Moment Spaces are main deck? Uh, three. We can find one. Okay, that didn't help at all. Uh, so we have to burn the full seven. And then we're gonna have three mana if we have an untapped land, and this is an untapped land. So that's the three mana we need. Uh, we still have green there and green there, so we are just gonna bang it out here. Uh, black mana. And uh, we forbid an alchemy. We'll, we, uh, let's find the moment's peace. It's not the moment's peace. <laughs> We're dead. Uh, that did not work out as expected. So now we probably should just concede. Uh, yeah. Okay. So against that deck, we definitely need Circle of Protection Green. I say we need Oraflex, Electricery. We don't need these guys. Can we finish the game with... You know what we don't need? We don't need uh, expensive counter spells, I think. Why isn't the fourth moments piece in the sideboard? Uh, I'm gonna go less counter magic. Less expensive counter magic. I think. We gotta cut two more cards. Horror doesn't work or really, does it? What's the last card to cut? actually think it's a condescend or a pulse what would you have cut I'm cutting a pulse I am definitely not sure I don't even remember if this is a problem matchup for the deck as I've been away for four months I do love with that we still played in Rova Horror as if it um, it's real this is 
compared to Red Green Tron that I played so much of, this deck has such a hard time finding Tron. But this is way too slow, right? You can't keep a hand like this. He will just run me over. This isn't much better, but I'm gonna keep it. That will help, right? Yeah. Always begin with the Ursa Lamb. Don't do what I did there, because... You might luck into the other ones. Okay, luck into land. That's what we need to do. Uh, this could be a problem. Super slow opening on his side. And we have a terrible opening as well, of course. Now we really need the land. If we miss the land here, it's a ginormous problem, but we don't. So what do we do here? I think it's alchemy for land. But his clock is very fast here. <laughs> Could kill us in two turns. Yeah, uh, we could be dead next turn. An ancestral mass kills us, right? Does it? Uh, it? It gives plus eight, right? And this gives plus four. It doesn't kill us. We have one more turn to live. Uh, I think I can afford to not do stuff this turn. So I'm alchemying, looking for mine. And I don't find a mine. So I'm taking the Signet, I think. Playing the Tornwood Falls. Because now I will have to cast Moments Peace next turn. Unless I die this very turn. Or Medillo Cloak definitely doesn't kill me. That's good. Okay, we're now trapped under our own, own weight. Uh, but we do have Flicker. So Moments Peace. Play the Signet. We really need to find... Uh, the Mine. Right? But this turn we have moments peace. Can't do anything else. He does have trample, so we are dead. Oh, we can uh, moments peace evoke Maldrif the next turn. Uh, green. I don't know if that was the right. Now we got. Yes. Circle of protection green would be super powerful here. I'm evoking... I need one more mana. I have five mana. Horror. What could Horror do? He isn't very good, is he? We need to evoke here. We have to. The, if we just sit back and play Moments Peace... It ain't gonna get us nowhere. Or is it? We are sure to survive another turn. And if we woke and don't find the land, we are dead. Uh, so I am going to uh, just moments peace. Uh, not looking very good here. Circle of protection green, very good in this situation. Uh, I'm not blocking. And here we go. And now our problems are deep. 
There we have a power plant. That's not good enough. We'll play the Mall Drifter. We find a crop rotation. That's interesting. So we can crop rotate. But uh, we can't really survive, can we? Because we need to find a moment's peace. I do crop rotate the island into a mine. And now we have three mana, five mana. So I can evoke another Maldrifter. And look for a moment's piece. But now I really have to find a moment's piece. And I do find Circle of Protection Green a bit too late. I'll just show it to him. <laughs> yeah, I think this would be a problem matchup. I'll post you the decklist and see what you think about it. And I hope I will be able to be back with the video. And uh, thank you, Maximum Mike. You too. And uh, goodbye.